every turn. There's a letter for you. Strange how the messages never come while you're home. It is apparently not enough that the Kunari define my political life. They must also infect what I hold personal. It is my son, Seamus. The life you saved, he would now squander by converting to the Kun. He has left for the Kunari compound. Please, Sarah Hawk, convince Seamus to come home. The Arishak says nothing good about Kirkwall, yet he accepts conversions. I cannot understand him. Maker knows I've tried, but he landed with, what, a few hundred men? Add up the deaths and defections, and the Arishok must need to bolster his ranks. I'm sure my son is quite the symbolic prize. Did anyone else see him leaving for the compound? He made no secret of it. I'm sure he intended it as another of his statements about closer relations. Your example inspired him. I might agree, but now is not the time. These matters are... delicate. He's politically dangerous, you mean? The office must remain strong, Sir Arhawk. He is of age. The decision seems rightly his. I want to let him find his way, but in my position, he's taken a great deal of inspiration from you. I want to allow his idealism, but not blindly. At best, my opponents will claim that my office is now in Kanari hands. At worst, I lose my son. He's your child. How fast can he be? Who knows? He might actually listen to you. No one else has dealt as closely with the Kunari. I hope he will see that we can be accepting and still be a proud citizen of Kirkwall. I wish we could all see that. Seamus isn't the type. Let's go. You were allowed, Basra, till the Arishak declares. 
proves otherwise. Well, hope the Viscount's boy hasn't settled in. Sirrah Hawk. I'm here about the Viscount's son. Are you? In four years, I have made no threat, and fanatics have lined up to hate us simply because we exist. But despite lies and fear, Baas still beg me to let them come to the Kuhn. They hunger for purpose. The son has made a choice. You will not deny him that. Converting the Viscount's son? His opposition will have a field day. And? The enemy of your enemy should be your friend? I don't fear the whole of them together. And it is not my role to reject the free choice of Vidathari. The son responded to his own demand of the Kuhn. He is neither my slave nor my prisoner. He is not even here. He went to his father. Ask the Viscount why he would send you and the letter both. That seems strange. They are meeting at the Chantry. A last pointless appeal, I assume. I doubt he'd involve the Chantry in such a personal matter. No, but we know who would. Mother Patrice. A suspect in many things. If she has threatened someone under my command again, there is only one response. I've had about enough of Patrice, several times over. A threat against Vidathari can have only one answer. I will suffer only one outcome. I will be watching, Hawk. The demand of the Kuhn is clear. Sarah Hawk, look at what you have done. To pounce upon the Viscount's son, a repentant convert in the Chantry itself. A crime with no excuse. Your Kunari masters will finally answer. All this will do is make people hate you. I have kept the fear of the Kunari fresh in every sermon, every prayer. They will know whose word to believe. When people learn of this attack, they will rise. Not zealots or the unknowing, but the true majority. Great plan. Until people start dying in a war with the Canari. To die untested would be the real crime. People need the opportunity to defend faith, starting with you. Earn your reward in this life and next. These heretics must die! Go for the Do you see, Your Grace? Traitors attacking the very core of the Chantry. They defile with every step. There is death in every corner, young mother. It is as you predicted, all too well. She's onto you, Patrice. Quick, lie harder. 
Don't you spout your Kunari filth! This is a hand of the divine! I have ears, Mother Patrice. The Maker would have me use them. Viscount Dumas' son is dead. Killed here in your name. I'm sure my name won't like that. Patrice? Seamus Dumas was a Kunari convert. He came here to repent and was murdered. Love or hate the Kunari, a blind nug could see she took this too far. No price is too much when we speak of eternity. Eternity is long enough that we need not rush to meet it. They deny the Maker. And you diminish him, even as you claim his side. Andraste did not volunteer for the flame. Sarah Hawk, you act on behalf of the Viscount? The young mother has erred in her judgment. A court will decide her fate. The Chantry respects the law, and so must she. Grand Cleric? Grand Cleric? We protect those of the Kune. We do not abandon our own. Please, send for Viscount Dumas. My son. Murdered in the heart of the Chantry by those who held a sacred trust. What hope for this city when we fail our own so completely? This is not over, Excellency. The city needs a leader. It does. And I am no longer that person. Please. Hawk. Leave me. So, everything is great now. Kunari and the Chantry and a dead son will just fade from memory. I doubt any side was satisfied. And now? The Arashok's the one to worry about. So we clean up and wait for trouble to find us. This is important. Don't interrupt with your selfish prattle. Get off your high horse. I have problems too. Ha! 
<laughs> what drink should I order and who's the father? Oh, you little... Are there any good seats left? Hawk, the Arashok is sheltering two fugitives who have converted to the Kune. He must be convinced to release them. He's already feared because of Patrice. If people start to think he can ignore the law, I need your help so this doesn't get out of hand. I'm going to die. There. Got your attention? Real problem. Hold on. What's this about? Remember the relic? The one Castillon is going to kill me over? A man called Wall-Eyed Sam has it. If you help me get it, Castillon won't kill me. Please. I'm trying to keep the entire city from rioting against the Canari. Well, maybe it's connected. What? I'm just saying maybe it will help. It's important to someone, right? Now you start being responsible? Shit. You're sure this is the relic you're after? I've had my ear to the ground for a while. There was a description of the book. It's the right one. Book? I thought you didn't know what the relic was. Well, I... I, I know it's a book, but that's all I know. It's written in a foreign tongue. Honestly, what does it matter? It'll save me from Castillon, so I need it. Why has this come up so suddenly, Isabella? Sam's been talking to black market dealers all over Lowtown. It didn't take me long to get wind of it. What frustrates me is that he's held onto the relic so long. Tell me about Sam. Sam used to run with Martin. Remember him? Martin says Sam's a bit of a magpie, picking up things that don't belong to him. Not a trustworthy sort. When Martin gave up raiding, Sam became a drifter. Who was involved in this exchange? To Vinter Mages. I doubt they'll look kindly on us interrupting. Bring a sword, or twelve. This seems like an issue for you and your guards. Quite a few of them. Sending a full patrol would just increase tension. But you're right. I am the captain. It's my responsibility. But I suspect the Viscount was hoping I would bring this to you. Then he should have come himself. Perhaps. But it's understandable that he's not at his best. I'd like to help him if I can. Isn't it odd that someone would run to the Canari? They're elves accused of murder. Maybe they feel they've nothing to lose by fleeing the alienage. And if their conversion is genuine? I don't know. But how many more will try if I allow this? Justice must be respected. You're expecting trouble? After what happened to the Viscount's son? Yes. I'm hoping the Canari aren't looking for a fight. I'm hoping they'll be reasonable. But we'll see. The relic issue has to be resolved before we take on the Kunari. You trust her this much? Probably not. I wouldn't. They won't wait at the compound forever, Hawk. I really do hope this helps, because if it doesn't... You think I like having this thing on my mind? Come on. The exchange is happening tonight in a low-town foundry. Are you sure about this? The champion was asked to go to the Canari. I suppose you think he planned the entire thing. Considering what it led to. Come on, Seeker. I'm not going to sell Hawk short. But nobody could have foreseen the way that that would go down. Or do you still think I'm lying to protect my friend? There are elements of your story that make sense. And you couldn't have known about them otherwise. Well... That's a relief. But that doesn't mean you're telling me everything. I want this story to be told. You're not the first to get it all wrong. I think I owe Hawk that much. Welcome home, Messiah. May I say again how thankful I am you've allowed Sandor to remain. He seems very happy.
I can make it for you. I make enchantments. Surrender the relic. I don't have your stupid relic. Arashok asks why we killed his men, we'll say it was an accident. Uh, yes. About that. The relic belongs to the Kunari, and there's a small chance they want it back. Do the Kunari look like the sharing type to you? Of course they want it back. I've always known what the relic is. I just didn't want to worry you. You're the picture of kindness, Raveni. The relic is a Kunari text handwritten by that philosopher of theirs. Uh, Keslan, Kuzland, whatever his name is. I stole it from them. They followed me here to reclaim it, and it's why they're still in Kirkwall. And they can't leave without it. 
All of this could have been avoided. How did you steal the relic from the Kunari? The Arashok never had it. The Orlesians did. They had plans to return it to the Kunari. I simply had to waylay the Orlesian convoy before it met up with the Arashok and his men. Getting the relic was easy. Getting away from the Kunari was the hard part. Maybe giving it back would solve Aveline's problem. It couldn't hurt. Says you. I know it will save my skin. Ah, oh, Why can't this be as easy as you? I thought you and the Kunari were caught in a storm. The storm was only half of it. I also had the Kunari Dreadnought stuck to my behind like a bad rash, spitting fire and thunder at me. Why would anyone besides the Kunari want this relic? The Tevinta Imperium have been at war with the Kunari for centuries. If the Tevintas get the relic, it will strike a blow to Kunari morale. That's probably what the mages want. All this is your fault. I should have handed you over to the Kunari years ago. And what would that have accomplished? They don't want me, they want the relic. Look, the book's right in this building, and I'm not letting it slip away again. There's more at stake, but... Well, the Arashok waited this long. Oh, I don't know. It's the only thing that'll get Castillon off my back. Please, tell me you'll give the relic to me. The artifact belongs to the Kunari, and you'll let them leave with it. There's a cost to both sides. Don't you understand? The relic is the only thing that will keep Castillon from feeding me to the sharks. I can't believe you're... Oh! <sighs> Fine. You're right. I'll return the relic. It'll go straight to the Kunari once we get it. Come on. We've no time to waste. Where is the relic? I... Uh... I have it! The Tome of Koslan will not fall into Deventer hands! Blood and spite! I toss Kanari! He's getting away! Isabella! Everyone stay still and try not to make any loud noises. Watch where you step.
someone's left a surprise here for us. deal with the Arashok and the fugitives ourselves. That's good. That's enough. Let's go to the compound. I'd wrap up any other business before we go. It's already a mess, and could get worse. Let's go. I request an audience with the Arashok. He will allow it, but not in this number. I will only bring my friend here and a small compliment of my guard. Is that few enough? It is. Enter. Shenadon. Greetings, Arashok. We come regarding the elven fugitives that took refuge here. Irrelevant. I would speak to Hawk about the relics stolen from my grasp. One of my former companions stole it. Her part was clear. Your admission is welcome. An issue for another time. We're here for the fugitives. The elves are now Fidithari. They have chosen to submit to the Kuhn. They will be protected. Surely you know these elves are only here to escape justice. Kirkwall justice. You have not hidden the abuses of your zealots or the corruption of this city. You will understand why I must do this. Let us look at your dangerous criminals. Speak, Vidathari. Who did you murder, and why? A city guard forced himself on our sister. We reported him, or tried to, but they did nothing about it, no matter what we said. So my brothers and I paid him a visit. That doesn't excuse murder. Are these elves telling the truth? There have been rumors. I will investigate, but they still took the law into their own hands. Sometimes that is necessary. Like you avenged the Viscount's son. It was not right then, and it's not right now. I would have done the same thing in their shoes. Hawk, that's not helping. 
Their actions are mere symptoms. Your society is the disease. They have chosen. The Vidathari will submit to the Kune and find a path your way has denied them. You can't just decide that. You must hand them over. Tell me, Hawk, what would you do in my place? Why pass up perfectly good converts? Exactly so. I cannot leave without the relic, and I cannot stay and remain blind to this dysfunction. There is only one solution. Arishok, there is no need for... Venekathas. Can you hear it? The Canari must be spreading out. They're attacking the city. Why? What could they possibly hope to accomplish? Somehow, I don't think the Arishal cares what happens after this. You may be right. Whatever it is, we need to do something quickly. But we'll need some help. Let me guess. Our friends from Parvalan decided to take over after all. The Canari are assaulting the city, and fast. The Arashok planned this for who knows how long. We should head to the keep to rally my guardsmen. Whatever happens, be careful.
Somehow I knew it would be you. Carver! Hello, big brother. Fancy meeting you here. Are you injured? Are there more of you? I'm fine. We're fine, and no, this is all of us. You have our sincere thanks. This attack was... most unexpected. Stroud, we need to move. We've already delayed too long. Very true. I cannot believe the Kunari would dare such an attack. This will lead to war with the Free Marches for certain. I fear pressing matters take us elsewhere, but we can spread word to the other free cities. Perhaps they will bring aid. There's something more important than an invasion. We can't talk about it. The Kunari are of far greater concern to you, I'm certain. But we must return to our mission. Wait. I need to tell you about Mother. I already know what happened. I'm sure you did your best. This is not the time. Take this. It is all we can spare, but perhaps it will be of use. Goodbye, big brother. Take care of yourself. Make her watch over you, my friend.
Kill them all! Shara, quit your struggling, woman. Tepa! Boss! Then the Aeroshock failed to take you captive. Unfortunate. The name Hawk has turned up in my reports many times. Too many. It's good that we found you, Knight Commander. The Canari are... It's obvious what they're doing. The Canari are taking people to the Keep, and may already be in control. We will need to deal with them. Why would they be gathering hostages? They're going to take everyone of import and put them in the same place. Those that agree to convert, live. Those that don't. Charming. Always happy to help in a life-threatening crisis? Good. I'll overlook your own use of magic. For the moment. Head to the keep and I will see if I can find more of my men. These creatures will pay for this outrage. We're good.
Looks like you've fared better than the other mages. The others? Surely they cannot all be. Gone. I told them to run. First Enchanter Orsino, you survive. Your relief overwhelms me, Knight Commander. There is no time for talk. We must strike back before it's too late. And who will lead us into this battle? You? I will fight to defend this city as I have always done. To control it, you mean? I won't have our lives tossed to the flames to feed your vanity. I won't have you two at each other's throats. I'm in charge. You! You're not even of this city. Neither am I. Yet I don't hear you complaining about us both fighting to defend our home. Very well, then. But whatever you plan, be quick about it. Tell us, then. What is our course of action? I take it running for the hills isn't an option? Or we could find out what they're up to. That works, too. An excellent choice. Let's move quickly.
there seem to be a great many Konari at the Keep's entrance. Then they've already taken it over. Clearly, they've been planning this for some time. I don't see any of my guardsmen. This is the only way in. We must assault them now before their numbers grow. Are you mad? They have hostages. We need a distraction. Decide quickly. We have no time. You win. We'll do it your way. Orsino, make sure there are no surprises. We need to find the Viscount, and quickly. There's more coming! Go. We'll deal with them. Here is your Viscount. You dare? You are starting a war! Look at you. Like fat duff Russie, you feed and feed and complain only when your meal is interrupted. You do not look up. 
You do not see that the grass is bare. All you leave in your wake is misery. You are blind. I will make you see. But we have guests. Sinead Dawn, Hawk. I expected you. Moras to Ebreshok. You alone are Basili Dan. This is what respect looks like, boss. Some of you will never earn it. So tell me, Hawk. You know I am denied Parvalin until the Tome of Kosloon is found. How would you see this conflict resolved without it? <laughs> I believe I can answer that. I'm sure you'll find it mostly undamaged. The Tome of Kozloon. It took me a while to get back, what with all the fighting everywhere. You know how it is. You betrayed me! That's a little dramatic. We could have prevented this if you hadn't stolen the damn book. Could we? Maybe you're right. Normally, I wouldn't have cared. I was halfway to Ostwick before I knew I had to turn round. It's pathetic. The relic is reclaimed. I am now free to return to Parvalin with the thief. What? Oh, no, no, no. If anyone kicks her ass, it's me. She stole the Tome of Kozloon. She must return with us. Sounds like you have something very specific in mind. She will submit to the Kuhn and the Ben Hasroth. More than that, I will not say. Isabella will answer according to our lords, not yours. Then you leave me no choice. I challenge you, Hawk. You and I will battle to the death with her as the prize. No! If you're going to duel anyone, duel me! You are not Basili Dan. You are unworthy. Don't you have what you came for? You know we do not suffer thieves. She cannot walk away from this insult. I will take her. If you object, duty demands that we fight. All right. Let's dance. Maravas! So shall it be!
return. Is it over? It's over. The city has been saved! It appears Kirkwall has a new champion. You seem confused, Seeker. The champion killed the Arashok in single combat? It just sounds so... romantic. Hmm. If I didn't know better, I'd say you're developing a little crush. Don't be ridiculous. The champion just seems very... heroic in your tale. Mm-hmm. If you're telling the truth. If you are, then... What happened at the gallows may be far different than we assumed. I need to hear it. Let's say I tell you. Then what? Are you hunting for an infamous apostate? Is that what this is all about? Or is it revenge? No, it's not that. Then what about me? If what I tell you isn't what you want to hear, will you still let me go? I will let you go. Well, now we're talking. None of this is what I thought it would be. Tell me what really happened. Champion of Kirkwall. That was the reward. <laughs> A fine title. Every noble at the Keep owed the champion their lives. He wasn't just a hero. He was now the most important person in the city. Except for Knight Commander Meredith, of course. With the Viscount dead, she stepped in to keep order. Things quickly got out of hand. The more she squeezed the mages, the more they resisted. The more they resisted, the tighter she squeezed. After three years of that, it all came crashing down.